How has the season gone in terms of you know, your achievements and when you set out at the beginning and set your goals, have you got close to all of them? You know, I ran a personal best this year, 52-6, um, and that was after an injury. Um, I got in, er, injured very early on in this year, which put my, set my season back. Um, again, I got injured again after running really fast, so that set my season back. So, you know, but at the end of the day, I'm happy with it. Um, I came out, I gave it my all today, and that's all I can ask for. Did it finish the way you expected, the one, two, three? Um, you know, I definitely think going in the, my, what my predictions for medalists, maybe not in the order I would have wanted, but definitely the, the people that got medals, I think, are the ones who deserved it. <laughs> um, it's been a, a different kind of games in terms of the weather and stuff like that. Have you managed to adjust, and what did you think of the crowd here at the World Championships? Oh, the crowd is amazing. You know, having just the seats go all the way around with the crowds filled every seat is absolutely amazing. The fans are so supportive, and you don't always get that in, at every championship, so I'm definitely thankful for that. What happens next for you? Next for me, I'm going to go run some, finish up the Diamond League season, um, and that'll be it. And I'll just go home, taking a break, and getting ready for the next season. We're done today. Thank you very much. Please delight that. U.S. is so stacked in the hurdles, both 400 and 100 hurdles. Um, what would you say is the secret behind the U.S. success in this um, in hurdling? You know, I don't know. I think you know, iron sharpens iron, and when you have one person that can do something really, really amazing, it it boosts the rest of the field. So I think that's just what we've been going off of. You know, maybe we had one person do it in the past, and in order to get on the team, you have to be absolutely phenomenal just to get here out of the U.S. So I think that's just what it is, and we compete, you know, a year round with each other. So I think we just all make each other better. From being Olympic champion and now getting a world silver, what are your main objectives over the next three years and leading to the next Olympics? You know, I definitely still have my sights set on a, a, a world champion gold. I think I'm capable of it, and that's definitely what my eyes are set on. Fantastic. Good, um, congratulations for the silver. Thank you very much.